Good day, Tampa Bay. I'm Charlie Belcher coming to you from Cigar City Brewery. And if there were a rock star, the biggest rock star in the craft beer business when it comes to Tampa, it's this guy right here. Joey Redner is the, the godfather of craft beer in Tampa. <laughs> Don't feel like that way. Man, that's a, that's, you're that's putting a, a lot, lot on of me there. Pressure, right, Jimmy? <laughs> In reality, you're the most successful craft uh, brewery, uh, and you paved the way for a lot of uh, men and women who are now in this business in Tampa Bay and thriving. Well, you know, shoulders of giants. There was a lot of people here doing a lot of great things before me. We, we kind of took the ball and ran with it. Um, you know, Bob Sylvester at St. Somewhere yeah. had, a, had a brewery before I Bob's did. Bob's really the godfather, by the way. <laughs> Tampa Bay Brewing Company was doing great things, but they, you know, they were a brew pub. I just yeah. had kind of been around the country and saw, you know, what some possibilities that I thought some things that we weren't doing, and I decided I was going to try to do more of those yeah. things. So. You wanted to build a better beer, yeah, well, right, yeah. and you did, yeah. <laughs> Sales proven. <laughs> there you Sales go. Sales proven. <laughs> uh, did you? In fact, you sold your first one seven years ago yesterday. Yeah. Yeah, Could you up. ever have foreseen seven years down the road where you uh, are now? You know, it's funny. I had some like handwritten projections uh, of where I thought we'd be, like sort of year out, year out. And I, I really thought that at about year five, which was two years ago, we'd be doing about 5,000 barrels. Uh, we did over 61,000 barrels last year. So, wow. so I, I, by a factor of 10, I was wrong. <laughs> How many? And, and that's the right wrong that yeah. you want to be. Um, how many different beers you're brewing now? Do you know off the top of your head? I mean, I know it's... Uh, you know, we're, if, you, if you count just straight sort of different recipes as opposed to treatment, sort of taking one beer and maybe aging it on food right. or something, uh, we've probably done four or five hundred different ones. If you look at our total portfolio, it's up around a thousand. Uh, but during the course of the year, we probably do anywhere from 35 to 70 different beers. Yeah. And it really just depends on, on tank space availability and how things open up. You know, some beers take longer to make, so especially when you're, when you're aging them on other mm -hmm. ingredients. So it just sort of depends on, on how the tank utilization falls, how many we can sort of shove through the year. Where do you, how do you continue to grow? Is it nationwide? Is it, is it better brews, better recipes? Is it, it just barrels sold? I, you know, I think, what, I, I think the success for any brewery is sort of keeping, keeping your approach to brewing true to the reason you got into it. Um, and then also, as you get larger, you really have to have this just unwavering focus on consistency and, and quality. Uh, you know, it has to be the same experience every time. When you're a little bit smaller as a brewer, you can sort of you can sort of follow your whims, and it doesn't necessarily have to be the same beer every time, as long as it's a good experience every right. time. But once you start down the road of being a packaging brewery, you know, when someone goes to the grocery store and they buy a six pack of High Lie or, or whatever it be, it has to be the same experience they had you know, the, the time before, the time before, the time right. before. Uh, so you really have to invest in that. And we've, I mean, we've thrown tons of, of money and time and focus on, on the QAQC side of things to make sure that, that everything we make is what we made the previous time. Quality control. Yeah. The 4 a.m. newscast has to be just as good as the 9 a.m. newscast. Exactly. <laughs> Joey Redner, always a pleasure, my friend. I'm always rooting for the home team. That's why I'm rooting <laughs> for Cigar City. Thank you. Stick around, everybody. Tampa Bay Beer Week. Uh, go have a local craft brew somewhere and celebrate. Stick around, more Good Day Tampa Bay right after this.